people, what's up guys? Welcome to the Chelsea Man Football. Good morning, afternoon, wherever you are around the world. Yesterday I posted a video about Timo Werner. Timo Werner is leaving Chelsea on loan. No, 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 it's not on loan. It's leaving permanently. Permanently is leaving Timo Werner. I was shocked <laughs> when I heard that. I love Timo Werner. I'm a fan of Timo Werner. I did not want him to go permanent, but it looks like it's gonna go permanent. He's gonna go to his old club, <laughs> where he came from. So, that was a little bit of shocking. I think, I think there was something very serious, very serious going on, guys. <laughs> very serious. I think, Thomas Tuku and Timo Werner, they had a fight. I think so, because he cannot decide to go right, you know? Right now, he's just like, okay, I'm just gonna go permanent. Doesn't make sense. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. There's something serious happened there. <laughs> My God. So, he's leaving permanently. What a surprise. I thought Timo Werner is gonna stay and fight for his place because I, this is what I was thinking. Lorraine Sterling, together, uh, together with Timo Werner, I think there will be chemistry there. There will be chemistry. But I wanted to see that partnership. I really wanted to see that before uh, Timo Werner decided to go on loan. I, I was thinking maybe it's going to go next summer because there, was a, there will be another transfer window, the short one. In a, in, a, in a season. So I thought Timo Werner is going to do that. But doesn't look that way. Looks like Timo Werner is gonna leave for permanent. Wow, what a surprise. It's okay, let's go into it. The big guy, Fabricio Romano, has reported Timo Werner on permanent deal to RB uh, Leisberg. Here we go, confirmed. Medical, medical test will take place this week, scheduled on Tuesday. Wow, <laughs> wow, it medical is gonna take place and this week and then scheduled on Tuesday and Timo Werner is gonna go. I'm a fan of him as I said before. I just really like Timo Werner. I know he was not scoring, but I really like him. <laughs> I don't know, I just like him. He's a good guy. So the club uh, prepare documents to be signed today. Final details of uh, the art ones and structure discussed with Chelsea but deal is done Ooh, the deal is done already <laughs> wow I, I'm gonna miss him anyway I'm gonna miss the Champions League go against Real Madrid uh, you know if, when he was not scoring at all and then he scored in a Real Madrid game that was good to see so good remembrance good days for uh, my guy Timo and I wish you the best of like you know your career and you know things happen you go to this league and you perform you go to another league and you don't perform things happen that's what it is maybe english football was not for him he find it very difficult because the defender in the, in the premier league they're just crazy <laughs> it doesn't matter any team you face they're gonna tackle you they're gonna injure you the defender that's what they are in the premier league they are rough and very strong <laughs> so so uh timo vena deal will be completed on monday rb riceberg and chelsea have full agreement permanent deal confirmed as revealed yesterday no loan with buy option all parties will prepare documents in order to sign the agreement next week wow okay the agreement next week, Timo going all happy. I think Tuku is happy Timo is going. <laughs> I really do, yeah. He's happy, so no striker. And I don't, why we have no link to any striker? I don't know why. It's so shocking if you, if you see, like, what's going on? There's no news about it, but we need a striker. You can even see we need that top man full force who can score goals for us in season. The way we are playing, and if we have a goal scorer striker, we'll be fine. We'll be absolutely fine. 
that game against Everton, it's just Everton was so much defensive. They went five in the back, four in the midfield. <laughs> they were defensive. That's why we couldn't break through because I saw other people and they're like, oh, we play so bad. Look at what Chelsea did. We didn't play bad. We didn't play bad at all. I, I went to rewatch that game again. I was like, no, Everton was so defensive. They're just waiting for the counter-attack. Once we, we lose the ball, they run for the counter-attack, but that didn't work for them. But because that's what they did last season, the same thing. They won one nail, <laughs> they just on counter-attack. So this is what they did. They were just defending, that's why we couldn't break through. So, we need a striker. Honestly, at this point, I will get Ronaldo. <laughs> I will get Ronaldo right away. I don't know why Toby is insisting to get Ronaldo. He's scared it's going to happen like Lukaku thing. Remember what happened? I don't know why. At this point, get Ronaldo. So the season, you know, can be fine all one season. And then next season, we figure it out to get a striker. We have no striker. What are we waiting for? The, the Premier League is is uh, happening, no striker, and then we're going to have the same problem like we had last season without a striker. Misses after misses, you, you, you give a ball to Kai Havertz, he misses. He put the ball in the bin. <laughs> what are we doing? Link uh, defender, We I think for me right now, if Fofana didn't, that doesn't work, it's okay, we have Kukulela, we have a Trist in the back. I love Fofana, absolutely. I would love him to come to Chelsea, but right now, um, we don't have a striker. We need a striker really bad. So, and I just, uh, the other story, I just feel bad for Ronaldo because <laughs> you know how Manchester United, uh, yesterday games, oh my, Manchester United, wow shocking performance absolutely shocking nothing has changed in that club man nothing they are playing the same thing same thing all over again Maguire still in the back how can you put Maguire on the back like they never ran the lesson same thing they are losing to blight to blight on at home shocking I just feel bad for Ronaldo for my uh, for for on my part I feel bad for that guy I, I saw him on the bench, he just looked defeated, man. He looked defeated, like, what am I doing here? What is this? It is confused, because nobody wants him. <laughs> nobody wants him. Like, Chelsea, go get him. We, do, we need a striker for a season. Go get him. What are we waiting for? My God. It's so, so frustrating, guys. Striker is there, but there's nowhere. That's what happened with Kunde. We went to other uh, other pe other people and we left Kunde um, alone, and he's wondering why. So they don't want me. They they are going to get another people, but we started talking. That's what we're doing, and then we're gonna go to Ronaldo after that. Maybe I'm just saying maybe that's gonna happen. That is bad. If we want somebody, go get him, like we did. Why it took say no to Ronaldo? I don't know. Try him. <laughs> Trying. Oh gosh. Thank you guys for watching uh, the Chelsea Man Football. And I hope to see you very soon and have a lovely day and God bless.